How's it going guys? It's your boy Tor Crunch and in today's video we're going to go ahead and check out Brave Battles or PvP whatever you want to call it. It just dropped the new revamped uh, PvP section. Let's go ahead and check it out. I kind of I'm not going to lie I already saw this um, but I'm going to go ahead and make a video on it so you guys can uh, get my ideas and thoughts on it. So as you guys can tell I'm fourth seat. Um, pretty cool your boy has to represent uh, but fourth is a little weak so we're gonna try to get to this section right here but first off let's go ahead and read off what you can actually get so the way they f they did it they have rankings they go up to 10 and then you got these three sections I think that's captain that's lieutenant and then that would be second seed uh, okay um, and then one uh, three two three four five six seven eight nine ten uh, so basically uh, this is the weakest. This is the one that um, you don't want to be at. But even if you're here, I mean, you still get something. So, for example, if you're 1 through 10 on ranking 10, you get normal summon tickets times 5. If you're at the very last, you're unranked, you get 10 medals. Um, if you're above that, you get rare medals times 15, normal summons tickets times 1. So, the more of a, the, the, the higher you're ranked, the better you get, uh, better, like, things you get i guess the the better the prize i guess uh, and I, th I believe this probably comes out once a week just like it's been before in the past um and for example this one right here rank number nine um you get 200 rare medals and then premium summon tickets times three so it looks like the rare medals really increased or decreased in value so you can get a bunch more uh which also means the things that we're going to be able to buy are inflated the prices are super high uh, but yeah, for example, right now I'm in rank number four or yeah, rank number four and, uh, I'm actually unranked and I got for being unranked. I'm at rare metals times 150 premium sum. And then on top of that, I also get premium summon tickets times two normal accessory tickets times one. So, uh, not too bad, but I'm not, I'm not content with this. I'm definitely shooting for this, which if you get number one, which is let's be real i probably won't get that but let's say i get around this page look at the amount of rare metals you're actually able to get that's a lot of rare metals like i would be down to even be like in this section like i'm cool with 500 rare metals give me 500 you know and on top of that uh you get four to five star tickets times three three star or above accessory tickets times three so i mean these they give you better rewards i still feel like the rewards like the four star four to five star ticket and the three star accessory ticket or above i think those aren't really that much of an upgrade to compare to something like a like a brave soul tickets times two and then premium accessory tickets times six like i think they could have done a little higher when it comes to like the other than the rare metals you know the uh, a better prize but that's my thoughts pretty cool though i, I love the 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 whole thing they did there uh, it looks like you get a bunch more rare metals and now we get to the point uh, where, where you can actually use those metals and it looks like you could obviously still buy characters uh, Karin, Don Kanoji, Hisako, Hisako Gomaro, Shunsui, Jushiro, Genrosaki, Kaku, and Yumi Chika are in here looks like four stars are in here uh, I think what I the way I see I think these are new four stars like four stars that don't have that we don't have so they're new attributes, I guess. And so that means essentially that's a new character. So if you bought each Yumichi or Genesar or, you know, any of those, you're getting, uh, you're buying orbs basically is what you're doing. But 400 tokens, I don't think is worth um, 35 orbs. And the reason I say that is because, well, we'll get to it. There's other things that you can actually get. Um, soul tickets are 100 for 100 tokens for five soul tickets, which I think is a little overpriced. I probably won't be, you won't see me spending my tokens on that. But uh, you get into these, and uh, there's crystals now. You can actually purchase crystals, which you know is a little. Um, crystals aren't that important, but uh, what's actually important are these jewels and Hogyoku. Hogyoku are 300 medals per hogyoku i guess and i believe you can only get up to three maybe it's a weekly thing where you can only buy up to three a week hopefully that's what i'm hoping uh because 300 is not bad so at this point i'm at 1285 like that's enough to buy four but um i can't do that i can only do up to three 300 is not bad that's a reasonable price 
uh, definitely will be using my tokens on that. And then of course there's these jewels that you can actually also go ahead and purchase. Um, I think it's pretty helpful. Like for example, um, the way I was thinking about it, if you need like two large jewels and uh, two large stamina jewels and it's focus day and you can't get those two large uh, stamina jewels and you really want those just so you can max out that character, you can jump into the PVP section, buy yourselves um, 10 large jewels, which is actually not that bad for 20 tokens. I actually will probably be spending some of my tokens on these uh, jewels as well. So uh, definitely jewels and Hogyoku's is what I'm eyeing my, that's what I'm eyeing on and uh, probably gonna spend my tokens on. Uh, and then there's the accessory tab. It's a power heart, and then there's power heart times 10. Oh, whoa, that's not bad. Okay, okay. I, 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 I honestly didn't see this beforehand. I saw that power hearts times 10. I thought it was just one power heart. And uh, when I saw, because I saw this beforehand, when I saw the two star power heart for 150, I was like, for one, that's kind of stupid. But now that I see that it's for 10, 150 isn't too bad. I still feel like that's a little overpriced just because um we all know that accessories take a lot of fodder and a power heart even a two-star power heart 10 of them will maybe level up a three-star accessory you know what i'm saying like it's not worth 150 tokens i mean i don't know uh it's it's up to you how you spend your your tokens i won't be focusing on these um and then there's of course summon tickets which i feel like some of us were excited about i'm not too excited about um brave soul tickets you're looking at 300 tokens for one brave soul ticket so essentially i could buy myself four and that's nothing because i could get hogyokus with that and you know with these brave soul tickets you already know that that's most likely not good. i mean the chances of it yeah it's a pretty good chance you could get a five star but then again there's a really good chance you won't get a five star so uh i don't know you're kind of rolling your dice there I feel like if to be completely honest, my honest opinion out of everything here, the best thing to invest your tokens in are going to be these Hogyokus and jewels. This tab right here is going to be my best friend. I have a thousand two hundred and one thousand two hundred and eighty five rare metals. And this is probably where I'm going to spend it. You know what? While we're at it, we're going to go ahead and buy these, man. I don't need. I, wait, what? They're not letting... Oh, wait. I got it. Oh, wait. No, never mind. I got it. All right. So, there you guys have it. We got one. We got two. Hey, dude. I'm cool with this. I don't even care, dude. Two Hogyokus. I can get more six-star reviews out for you guys. Um, you know, then again, I wouldn't mind getting, like, a Karin or a Hizagomaru. Hiza, Why can't I say his name, bro? But, you know, I feel like those aren't going to be too hard to get anymore. Because, you know, 800 tokens uh isn't too hard to collect nowadays like even though i just bought three hogyokus i wanted to buy these just so you guys can see you cannot exchange any more for this item available this can i believe hopefully it's like a weekly thing because if it's a weekly thing i would buy the three hogyokus every week hopefully if i could afford it uh but yeah there you guys have it what do you guys think man this is actually pretty exciting um super pumped for this uh this is fun guys this is fun uh looking at the rewards looking at the metal exchange it's awesome one last thing before i finish the video off we're gonna go ahead and take take a look at the orders tab and uh we of course with the new pvp you actually get more orders in here uh, uh for you know gaining promotion to different seat uh, so they're called seat league i guess whatever so yeah you get more uh orders done and for example uh for gaining promotion to the ninth seed you get 10 brave uh, premium tickets uh gaining eight to the eighth seed you get a hundred uh tokens brave battle tokens i don't know if i've been saying that wrong i'm sorry and then of course you get uh 10 accessory premium tickets for seventh as you guys could tell we get pretty good pretty good ones um let's see uh if you get if i get to the third seed that will be 250 tokens which is not bad and i'm sure if you get to like five uh, to the first first seed or whatever the captain position i'm sure you'll get like about 500 uh, tokens so not bad guys super pumped for this let me know what you guys think think in the comments let me go check out and collect those three hogyokus just so you guys can see what to expect when you're spending your orbs 
I mean your tickets uh, there you have it we get three um, honestly super happy about this this is definitely gonna make me get into PvP much more I am going to be playing more to get those um, tokens it's gonna be more competitive let me know if you guys want to see videos on that uh, but anyways also let me know what you think about all of this I love you guys so much I'm done talking I've been talking for too long uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow in tomorrow's video uh, let me know what you guys think uh, I'm out peace